Okay, hi guys. Welcome to my November plan with me. I'm here with my fabric dory uh, planner. And um, like the last couple of um, setup videos, I'm just going to... Sh I've already set up. I'm just going to show you what I've done. And... Um, but first, first, I'll give you a quick flip through of October, even though we still have a few days left. So let's get started. Okay, so my first insert is my collections insert, and I have it tucked in to the front cover. Not many changes here. Uh, not as many as there should have been, but uh, two new pages. I um, This month I read The Miracle Morning by Hal El El Elrod. I don't know what's wrong with my pronunciation. I hope I said that right. And um, started doing it, the, the Lifesavers Every Morning. So I have that page here and um, the tracker you're supposed to to use for it but I wasn't using it and I started an annual log page here in my collections um, I will also have my uh, <clears throat> fourth quarter goals in here and then my annual strategy for next year will show up here soon so that's it for my collections then the my monthly uh, pages insert and monthly trackers and doo -doo -doo -doo. so this is what this looked like filled in um i put in my dates on my monthly log and the projects i'm working on for october were over here in the four categories my uh, scarlet moon creations business excelsior events business personal and spiritual next my habit tracker didn't go so well this month um i started off okay and then honestly really my habit tracker is the best way to figure out how i've been doing as a person just in general for the month um just the last two weeks my head has been in a fog and i have not been really active in um, any front so I did um, add a couple of things and somehow I forgot a bunch of stuff and then I added affirmations and um, a mood tracker which as you can see didn't go very well I'm just not used to doing it also I added I had three times a day and I it was a struggle to try to figure out how my afternoon went so I will do this again but only day and night and also uh, changing up what the categories mean with each color because I borrowed this from Boho Berry and she has you know all of these really positive <laughs> um, moods and then ugh and at first I was going to make this something else and then I whited it out and just put UG. And I realized just the way my personal mindset is, I need more of a variety in here. Um, another thing is somehow I did the days of the week wrong here at the top. If I can get it to zoom in there for a second. Oh, no, that didn't work out very well. But yeah, so I had to white all of this out and rewrite them after what I originally showed you guys. Then, um, fitness tracker. Uh, I kind of fell off on doing this. I did exercise more than shown here, but I did not fill this in. So I guess that's okay. Timetable. This, this, this is just, you know thing with me every month I'm still fighting to keep track of my time and yeah uh, I've got I did the same thing with the days of the week here I put them in wrong so I had to white it out and write over uh, my goal and reward system I didn't really 
do because I didn't put in rewards and I don't remember how. This will get filled out and if you follow me on Instagram at the messy bujo, you'll get to see what this looks like all filled out. And then um, this was something I added afterwards, daily affirmations. Um, this was part of the Miracle Morning and what uh, in September I was doing, I was watching webinars by Shelby from The Little Coffee Fox and uh, even before I read the Miracle Morning books I knew I wanted to try to work on some affirmations. So these are ones I pulled from the Miracle Morning and I will be creating new ones for myself. So, here we are. This is my November cover page. Red is my favorite color, you guys. Absolutely. And I'm going to be really real here. Um, I don't know if you can see, like, the, the tablecloth thing I have underneath. Um, I like, like, blood red. So, I decided November is going to be, like, a bloody red <laughs> color scheme with some black. So, kind of dark, but... I don't see it as a bad thing. Alright, so my November monthly, same setup. Um, I'll go in and put in my important events coming up and projects. Uh, the only thing I have here right now is your best year 2018 under personal. My November tracker, way more things going on here. So important to know is first I added the Miracle Morning um, Lifesavers here so I'm not looking at two trackers like I was last month and then uh, what else did I add I added a couple of other things business wise that I wanted to do um, and not just business wise but just overall um, I have some stuff in storage that I really want to sell so I'm going to do that um, I'm going to call family and friends actually more often so I'm adding that on here uh, work on business plans and contact vendors I really need to make moves on that and uh, create more relationships so I can get more clients and so that's a big deal the monthly review and the weekly review I actually added in last month's uh, tracker. I'll show you. They're here. Uh, so I just think that's a good idea to keep doing. What else did I add? Um, I think that's it. So at the bottom here, my mood tracker will be. Um, like I said, I'm just going to keep it day and night. And... My color scheme, two shades of red, black, and gray. Uh, and uh, this will just be my key, like, for the mood tracker. I just haven't decided um, what each color will represent. So the key is down here on this page, but I don't really have space, so it's going to be on the side. Next, fitness tracker. Doing it again. The timetable. I'm really, really trying <laughs> to get this done. And daily affirmations. This month, I'm uh, in the next um blah, blah, blah. November. I'm gonna hopefully be using my own personally created affirmations. So in the next couple of days, here in the end of October, I will be creating those affirmations. And saying them every morning and probably nights too. So that's the monthly pages. My content editorial calendar. So be prepared, guys. Prep yourselves for the... This um, first was my October content and editorial calendar. Not a lot going on this month, actually. Um, so November... I told you it was going to be red, 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 bloody red, and it is. Um, I can barely read some of the stuff I've already written on here, but 
I don't care. This is my birthday month. Um, my birthday is on the first, so like, I was like, I'm gonna make it red. I have no idea what color scheme I'm gonna do for December yet. Um, another thing. Uh, so the weeklies, right? Yeah, I started those, and I realized I started them uh, spread early. So now I'm gonna have to put March of 2018 towards the back. But whatever. So this is my first week in October. The second week in October. Kind of light here. I didn't really finish putting in stuff. And then I completely skipped. Like I did this but I did nothing. There's nothing on here really. So oh, I didn't renew. I haven't even renewed my driver's license. I didn't even finish that sentence. So yeah. Uh, and that's about it, I think. No, this was, the, yeah, I, I actually skipped the third week of October, because this was the second week, okay. And this was this past week, which I did get stuff done, but I didn't, because I did this Monday and while I was at a doctor's appointment. So, yeah, but, um... So far, so good with those inserts. Now, my dailies insert. Again, kicking myself for this index, please. I don't know. I don't know. Where are we? Okay, so October. God, I've been in this system for a month. Started off okay. Not too bad. I did not take, uh, finish taking the notes for, um... The nine to sim <clears throat> excuse me the nine to simplify webinar so I need to finish that because I have the second uh, the third fourth and fifth it was held and I didn't take any notes because I didn't get to watch those so yeah using my stabilos the colors on these pages look great 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 and then I decided I was going to go forward and um, try to use some watercolor and I forgot. Three pages a day is really tight, so sticking to two a day. Started using the watercolor backgrounds again. Um, did not work out so well. See, I skipped, what day did I skip? I skipped the 12th. And then mm, the 15th, and then I skipped that whole week between the 16th and the 23rd, um, and yeah, so I wasn't even checking things off, so like the my daily tracker tracker. And here we are with today, and that's, that's pretty much it. Um, I did do some readings. I actually did, um, an event on the 21st where I did paid readings, so I'm not going to show you those really, but, um, I'm in the midst still of doing the shadow work October. I am behind a bit, but not a lot, so I'm behind by about a week. And that was the Mandela I did for that. But I'm going to continue doing Shadow Work October. And yeah. So that is it. I'm all set up and ready for November. November is like mainly going to be family time. Um, last week was my brother's birthday. This weekend is my, or this week is my birthday or this upcoming week is my birthday. My mom's birthday is the week after that. My aunt's birthday is the week after that. Then we have Thanksgiving and Black Friday. And yeah, life is 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 crazy in November. And then we head into December with all the holidays and a couple more birthdays and um, my parents' anniversary. So November is going to be mostly family time and planning for next year. Um... I'm glad you guys sat through that. Thank you. I'll see you guys next month. Have a great November. Bye.